the Lord spoke to us that it's time for us to have a new minibus and we are believing God for a 17-seater minibus. It's an exciting time for us. It's a new chapter, something that we're doing that we have not actually done before. What is that? Uh, it's buying a minibus and not a 12-seater minibus or a 15-seater minibus. We're actually going for a 17-seater minibus. It's an initiative that we actually bring in to the local church and to the community. If we wanted to, we could buy one cash, but the Lord said there's something powerful about when people come on board and, and become a part of what God is doing. They can become a part of it. I mean, we've got a new children's group called Triversity. They are doing some sponsors um, like JAMA, baking, cakes. They are doing sponsoring and different initiatives. The Triversity is uh, a group of young people. These young people, they are vibrant, they are full of energy. They just come up with this name Triversity because they try. So we are aiming to get a minibus for these people so that they can explore, they can give to the community. Their aim is to visit the, the nursing homes, to sing to them, to help clean up. So there's so many things they are prepared to do. But for these things to move forward, we need a minibus. The benefits of having an old minibus is that obviously as drivers we want to go to our own events. We obviously want a minibus so we can go to them. And we want to go to places like Drayton Manor to have fun with each other. But we can't do that if we don't have our own minibus. Well, help us have mobility and we can go on trips, picnics. It will be more convenient for us if we have our own minibus. Because whenever we are going out, perhaps to conferences, you know, perhaps to maybe gathering and, you know, occasionally maybe we go to the beach and things like that, leisure time. Instead of hiding, yeah, when we have our own bus, mini buses, it should be easier, you know, for us to do all we want to do. And um, we can always meet, easily meet at the church and then use it, you know, mini bus to wherever you want to go. And it also will help us to save money instead of, you know, getting another bus and things like that. So I think it's, it, it will be, you know, paramount if we can have one. I think it's a nice way for the church to come together and just work on some things. It's a really good idea. I mean, it will be very different to have our own transport. And that means we will be a lot more independent. I think it will be really great. The benefits of having a minibus is that we can collect more people to come to our church to worship our Father. The children can go on trips and they don't, the parents don't have to worry about them because they go to one destination and come back instead of in several cars. And another thing is when there's events going on like conventions, etc, etc, we can take visits to other churches so that we can, you know, join in and participate rather than we just stay in one spot. I'm going to be raising money for the uh, minibus because it's, it's good, it will be good for uh, our church, it will be good for, for for the transportation if you are then traveling ar around as a church uh, and it's special for the kids as well when it's uh, school holidays you know you, you can take them uh, anywhere you don't have to worry about transportation and all, all these things and I think it would be very good for our church it would be great just by way of even pe picking up people in the local community to bring them to our events, whether it's our services or our social events, it will be great. We'll be raising money by sponsor sheet and that means that we'll be asking her relatives, family members to sponsor us in hoping to raise enough money or help fund the minibus. I think a lot of our members of our church, um, including like um, some of the young ones, they make their own way. So they have to catch the bus and they go from far and things like that. So then when we want to make a plans to go somewhere, we say, oh, let's all meet up somewhere. Not all of us are based in like close to the city centre. So it's hard to get about sometimes. So our aim is to have raised to have raised the money by October. We'll be getting a minibus in October. I'm so excited about it. We're going to be doing a lovely trip, traveling loads of places. I'm thinking we could probably start selling drinks at church. 
you know what I mean? That would help as well because the kids go to the shop all the time. So rather than them going to the shop, we could try and do, you know, so that we get a little bit here. We're also going to be doing a concert, and in that concert, we're going to have different dances, singing, maybe some acting too. And also at the concert, we're going to have a raffle where you can win stuff. On there too, and we were thinking about having a fundraiser, which the kids in Triversity have to do something, and if we sponsor them, they have to do it for even longer. Hopefully, it's going to be like an arm in the community, reaching out to people and bringing them closer to us, getting to know us, and it will be even an evangelism tool. Um, everything that we're doing, we just want to be outward looking. I think that would be very good and uh, encourage the kind of family atmosphere that World Life International has. So I'm really excited about it. So help us with our minibus, please. Sponsor us. Thank you. This is the beginning of great things to happen uh, in, in this church if you, we have our, our own minibus. It will be more accessible for everyone else. And we can go sponsoring to help this cause. Looking forward to work with these young ones. They are a great bunch to work with. And when we have our minibus, everyone will be able to look at it and think, I had a part in that and I think that's a great thing. So God bless you, it's gonna be awesome and if you are not involved, get involved. It's gonna be great. And so do you wanna be a part of it? If you wanna be a part of it, there's something powerful about helping somebody else to fulfill their vision. And so we open it to those out there who wanna be a part of what God is doing. Get on board right now. This is your season of unlimited possibility. Now, the good thing about this mini bus is the fact that we can utilize it for different things. We can use it for weddings, we can use it when we're going on trips, we can use it for holidays, we can use it for picnics, we can use it even for our new church that we're looking to start. So great things are about to happen and this is a great time for us to get on board and be a part of what God is doing because God is doing a new thing and it's marvelous in our eyes. He said, this is the day that the Lord has made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. And so I'm excited. You know, I believe that we are in the right timing. We are in the will of God. It's the right season, it's the right time. So what we are doing is getting on board. I wanna pray with you today. And as I pray with you today, I want you to reach out and receive by faith that which God has for you. Hallelujah. Lord, I pray in the name of Jesus. Lord, as I pray this day, I pray, Lord, that this minibus that we are believing for, Lord, I pray by the 15th of October, it shall be manifested in the natural. I pray that we shall have all the resources and the finances to, to, to pay for this, debt free in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Lord, I pray that this shall be a time of testimonies. Glory to God. That we shall testify of your goodness. We shall testify of your glory. I pray in the name of Jesus that lives shall be changed even as they sow into the work of God. That which they are believing for shall come to pass. I decree and declare that it shall be so. It cannot be otherwise. Glory to God. It is in the mighty and the precious name of Jesus we pray. Amen and amen. God is going to do some great things. And, and as you stand in faith with us, it shall come to pass. And that which you believe for, you shall receive it in Jesus' name. Amen. prophesy today that as this vision come to pass and we get in our minibus by the 15th of October 2018 that which you believe in God for will come to pass